Hi, I'm Ashley and welcome to Multiplying Unknown Numbers. In this video, we will practice solving for the unknown in multiplication problems. Are you ready? Let's go. In order to solve for an unknown in multiplication problems, it's important to understand the concept of fact families first. Notice here I have a multiplication and division set of fact families. So I have 2 times 3 equals 6. Switch those around. I have 3 times 2 equals 6. Then 6 divided by 3 equals 2. And 6 divided by 2 equals 3. Three. So I could use that to solve for an unknown in this way. Let's say I have five times an unknown number equals 15. Well, how would I figure that out? What I could do is I could use this as the beginning number in a division problem. So 15 divided by our first number, 5, is equal to what? Well, our number here is going to be the number we can fill in the blank up at the top. So 15 divided by 5, I know, equals 3. So if I know that, then I know 5 times 3 is equal to 15. Let's apply that with a few problems from our game. My first problem here, I have 2 times an unknown equals 8. So what I want to do to solve for this unknown is flip these numbers around into a division problem. 8 divided by 2 is equal to what? 8 divided by 2 equals 4. So 4 is our answer. And we could plug that in and check it if we want. 2 times 4, you know your facts, equal 8. And that is correct. Let's try another one. All right, now I have 2 times an un uh, unknown equals 34. Now if I flipped that around, 34 divided by 2, hmm, that's not part of my division facts that I've memorized yet. So let me see. Let me solve this another way. 34 divided by 2 this way. 2 goes into 3 how many times? 1. 2 times 1 is 2. I will subtract. 3 minus 2 is 1. Bring down my 4. 4, and then 2 goes into 14 how many times? 7. So here is my final answer, 17. 34 divided by 2 equals 17. Now I can check my work. So we said that our answer was 17. I'm going to check it by multiplying 17 by 2 to see if I get 34. So 2 times 7 is 14. And then 2 times 1 is 2. One more makes 3. 34, so I know I was correct. Great job. You have learned how to solve for an unknown in multiplication problems. As you play the game, the numbers will get progressively larger and Again, on our Multiplying Unknown Numbers 2 game, there will also be some larger, more challenging problems. But just remember, you can solve them the same way with our fact families. Now go practice what you've learned with our online games and quizzes, and remember to always be clever.